I came to take you, Roxanne, to be my wife. I will share my life with yours and build our dreams together, support you through times of trouble and rejoice with you. I promise to give you respect, love and loyalty. This commitment is made in love, kept in faith, lived in hope and made new every day of our lives. I, Roxanne, take you, Kane, to be my husband. I will share my life with yours and build our dreams together, support you through times of trouble and rejoice with you in times of happiness. I promise to give you respect, love and loyalty. This commitment is made in love, live in hope and make new every day of our lives. Now by the power vested in me by Kane and Roxanne, it is my honour and delight to declare you husband and wife. You may seal this declaration with a kiss. Rox looks fantastic, yeah. and you do, Kane. Both know each other from when you were little kids in the nursery, weren't you? Then you met again at Hanham High. It's been a wonderful day. I hope you have a long and happy marriage. Now to someone I can call my wife. She made me chase her for knows how long. <laughs> it, took, it, it took so long to get her, but being here today has made all that pain that six months that you put me through for to, to get there. <laughs> It's made it all worth it. I want to thank you for making me have OCD now. And I'll just let you know, I did Hoover before we come out and I pull the blinds like you like it when we're not there. I want to thank you for being the best mum I could ever, ever think of. Also, for making me a good parent, because I always bounce off yours, rely on what you say. So I want to thank you for that as well. One thing I hope she agrees with me on is this day is and has been a beautiful day for you both to cherish. I love you dearly, you too Kane, and it gives me great pleasure in raising the glass as we celebrate with them the marriage of Kane and Rock. Seriously, I, I think everyone would agree that Kane and Rocks are a match made in heaven. Kane's clearly got his wish today, not only marrying his childhood sweetheart, but knowing the bar closing at 10 is actually quite fitting considering his nickname at Cinderford was Cinderella, as you always guarantee be home tucked up in bed by 12 o'clock.